Let's make some broccoli and rice casserole in my new casserole crock pot. This is the size of a nine by 13 inch casserole dish and y'all, I have wanted one of these for months. All right, let's get to it. We are going to make this dinner style and add a protein, which is gonna be chicken. To a bowl, add in one 10 ounce can of cheddar cheese soup and one 10 ounce can of cream of chicken or the cream of chicken with herb. Either one's fine. One cup of milk. Now we're gonna season this up with some of Brits cooking a Cajun seasoning. Onion powder, garlic powder, a little bit of salt, and pepper. All right, now you're gonna whisk that shit. Right here I have two cups of cooked rice. I cooked this in chicken broth and seasoned it with salt, garlic powder, and onion powder. We're gonna add in the soup mixture. This here is three cups of broccoli that I steamed for six minutes. If you don't have a steamer, you can just parboil it for about four or five minutes. Go through and give your broccoli a rough chop. You don't want to pulverize it. You want to have a few bigger pieces, but chop it up. Now add this to your bowl. This is the meat from one rotisserie chicken. I shredded it up. Now we're going to add that in. All right, now the most important part, which is the cheese. We're going to do one cup of smoked Gouda and two cups of mild cheddar. Now, sometimes I'll use smoked cheddar. Sometimes I'll use just cheddar. Whatever cheese is fine, you just need three cups of it. Now, I like my cheesy, kind of like my jokes, but if you don't want it as cheesy, you can add less cheese. How many times can I say cheese in one video clip? I tossed my cheeses together, and now we're going to add a little more than half to our bowl. The rest you're going to save to top it with. I forgot to tell y'all, this bitch has a cord wrap. Now, if you were cooking this in the oven, you would do it at 400 degrees for 40 minutes. But we're cooking it in here, so I can't tell you how long we're going to be cooking it for, but at the end of this video, I'll let you know. I got it in here, and I'm going to use the rest of my cheese to top it. And then I like to add a little more Creole seasoning on the top of mine to make it look cute. So this is a warm, low, and high setting. I think I'm going to start it out on the low. But y'all, could you imagine showing up to the church potluck with this? You would be the belle of the Southern Baptist Church Ball. And it does have lid locks. That's for transportation only, okay? Don't be locking the lids on a crock pot when it's on, okay? It will explode. Can, will, might. All right, y'all, here it is, all done. I ended up switching this to the high setting, and it cooked for four hours, and it is perfect. The outside of it gets extremely hot. So if you end up getting this, be careful. All right, me and Bubba are going to do a taste test. Let's go. It's so damn good. All right, y'all. Thanks for coming to my fake cooking show. Bye.